This week, we're in Ferguson, Missouri for the Black and Brown Alianza event. And on Rooftop Live, we have slam poetry pioneer Saul Williams rocking for the people of St. Louis on And You Don't Stop. In the 1960s, the Black Panthers and Brown Berets worked hand in hand, addressing issues affecting the African American and Latino community. In the 1970s, the Young Lords affirmed their identity as Afro Boricua, serving their Black and Latino community in New York while also calling for Puerto Rican independence. January 15th, along with Heads Up United, we gathered in Ferguson for the Black and Brown Alianza event to revive this idea of unity against the common oppressor. You know, it's going to take a lot more than a language bar barrier and a couple borders and, and some oceans to keep people apart. Um, so what I hope to come from this, man, is, is nationwide unity where, uh, you know, we have communities that's black and brown, we, we, we share our culture and we share love for one another. Uh, we decided that it was important to to make connections. Uh, we got, you know, we got police killings in San Antonio too, uh, so we're just trying to make connections with people that are going through the same thing all around the country, so we can make a stronger national movement. Like we really need that unity to fight this common oppressor because he's been oppressing us all for too long. What is going to come out of here is going to be important for the work that we do internationally, and also the the work that we're doing in Ferguson to build more international. So understand that. Black lives matter, but we have to take it globally. I want to knock these barriers down that they got. You know, they always try to they always try to put the black versus the brown. You know, they try to make it seem like we don't get along with each other. We need to break that down first. And once we can break that down and come together, then we can move forward. See, I gotta draw the line. I can't take it no more. You ain't down revolution. What you waiting for? Making money for suckers and our community's poor. Ripping flags off of coffins. Man, this ain't our war. Colonized and terrorized by the world's biggest killers. The U.S. government, the, the biggest, biggest weapon in drug dealers. You know, my, my wife is an Afro-Dominican, you know what I'm saying, woman. And I feel like even within our community, we, we all have always, this is not something that we're talking about today. For us, the idea of black and brown alianza has always been that. Just off GP, like, that's, we all, you know what I mean? We all in this together, so for me it's, a, it's important though, because at the same time, even though I acknowledge it, don't mean that everybody from my community acknowledge it, just because, you know what I mean, other folks not, don't mean that they acknowledge it. So hopefully we can make this a building process so that we can build, uh, you know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, we the ones that, that, when you look at the prison population, it's all us regardless. It's not about, again, the phenotype, we're coming for you. And the reason they're coming for us is because they are clear they are the minority in the world. And they're becoming the minority in numbers in the U.S. So unless we get this together at this moment that Ferguson has birth, we will be a majority black and brown nation ruled in an apartheid state. Children of the night, bearers of the day torch scorched and burn, burn not, the dam is broken, the curse is fled. Once muddied and still, the river runs red. All those ships that never sailed, the wonders their sea cocks open, that light scuttled in their stalls today. I bring them back, huge and intransitory, and let them sail forever, forever. There are currents uncurrent. The wind cannot serve a truth's currency. Currently moon-marked and sun-sparked, unmarked bills. Will I am certain I speak a new language, as is always the first sign of a new age. I'd begun to believe my blackened toenails were on path to decay, when in truth they had begun the gradual process of crystallization. I'm he who walks in wind-scorned feet with toenails of amethyst and rose quartz, my path now crystal clear. I'm come to tell you, she is here. It is not written, 
No penmanship is ever cargoed with her character. Note, books are carefully folded forests, void of autumn, bound from the sun. Likewise, she made residence on the outskirts of history, on the dark side of the moon where the searchlight of the sun cannot spot her nor rot her. The seed of forbidden fruit, every tree has a hidden root, yet she has come to light the swelling patrick of vibrant dreams and to think of the girlfriend I was tempted to break up with because she slept too much. I now know they nurtured her there. They slept in packs, dreamt in cycles, nursed her in shifts, and became her on rotation. Unnamed every time she was named that she would not be known even unto herself. Undressed every time she was dressed that she would not be recognized anyone other than herself. They blindfolded her and spun her in circles that she would find her way here by no other means than her intuition. And she is come. I am a simple disoriented man in her presence. I wear my loincloth over my eyes and ejaculate too soon. Forgive me, Father, for I have sinned. I prayed to you and cup the wind, and in doing so, barred her entry into a century, 100 years of solitude. I will now pray with my hands outstretched with these psalms etched into my palms. Most beloved, I'm certain of nothing more than your existence. A thousand ants coming under a log may find themselves exposed to my childlike search for you, my Kali flower. I'm eternally destroyed by your love. No longer am I eligible for any worker's pension. My friends laugh at me and talk behind my back. They say that you've changed me, and I am. I'm like survivor of the flood, walking through the streets, drenched with God, surprised that all the drowned victims are still walking and talking. I rush to each victim's side, sucking what I can of you out of your various incarnations, pumping their stomachs and filling them. To touch them is to touch you, to kiss them is to kiss you, my friends. Love is an art form slightly removed from its element. And one may ask, well, what does this mean? I respond, I've made it up, but it shall be from now on. <laughs> from now on, cities will be built on one side of the street so that soothsayers will have wilderness to wander and lovers space enough to contemplate a kiss. She kisses if she alone could forge the signature of the sun. I close my eyes, although I never knew the difference. I stood before a brighter light at lesser distance and then a feeling, almost as if nothing were ever bound to be repeated ever again, as if history had been as massively created as the great pyramids and to reconstruct or relive any given moment would have to stem from an understanding of how the pyramids were built from the top down. And if one could understand such majesty, one would also understand that pyramids are first made of flesh and that kisses are portals our sacred breath shifting through hidden corrals and passageways. I will find my way to eternity within you when I can feel you breathing into me, I like a stone gargoyle atop some crumbling building, spring to life a resuscitated angel. I sweep through city streets, my wings outstretched, making mothers clutch their young and remember. And do you remember, dear ones, or has your history forsaken you? Amen. There are mysteries coded in song, chants sung round fires, all incantations calling forth this day. On this day, the drunks vomit in unison. The last night, they drank from different cups. Children laugh from play, introducing their parents and invisible friends. A country girl smiles and two trees blossom out of season. Sea suns awake and our mother has returned to wave us from uncertainty once tidal. Twice born of wooden ships, thrice formed through mother's hips. Mother ships grace two lips, a poet's garden. Two for five, the going fast, the future's bargain. That change of her my name, the river's parting. Hurry up, things worry up, the sun is darkened. Rivers like oceans, oceans like answers. Questions in cloud forms, raindrops and stanzas to be or not to to see or not to she had eyes like two turntables mixed her in between my dreams and reality blend in ancient themes the basis of Isis cross faded to Ankh the beat drops like a cliff overlooking my heart 6,000 feet above sea level 3,300 bodies disassemble, the head bones connected to the cockpit, knee jerk ass backwards, dancing slaves in a mosh pit, punk rock of Gibraltar, roll out, nothing's new, more blood dies than Mohawk, only this time it's you, and you never loved her for what she possessed, you powdered her face and came on her headdress, oil sick feathers, future stench waterbed, mother nature's a whore, said the shotgun to the head, and it smelt like teen spirit, angst driven, insecure, a country in puberty, a country at war. <laughs>